Hello! I have not made a YouTube video in ages. Um, actually, okay, it's only been two weeks, but um, it feels like much longer. Um, I don't know why, but I woke up this morning and I was like, I'm going to make a YouTube video! And I even went to the great extent of putting on makeup. As you can tell, a little eyeshadow, a little uh, lip gloss to uh, make the lips pop a bit more. <laughs> Um, yeah, I don't put on makeup for anything or anyone. Guys, no. Work, no. Why would I put on makeup for work? Um, anyway. Uh, oh yeah, I wanted to make a video for Valentine's Day, but I, um, ended up not making one because pretty much my entire family was, like, depressed and grieving because it was my, it would have been my brother's 19th birthday. And, you know, I thought it was going to be a happier day, but it wasn't. It was a gray, ugly, nasty day, and everyone was just kind of blah. Like, I don't know. Everyone was depressed because we all miss my brother. Um, so that kind of made me depressed because my mom was being weird, and my dad just, I don't know. Anyway, so it was kind of a sad day, um, and I didn't really feel like making a video. Um, but I got some cool things on Valentine's Day. And no, not from any suitors. Um, that was a weird way to say it. Uh, not from any guys, because I'm kind of anti-guy right now. Um, but on Valentine's Day, my family gives gifts to each other. Which, I don't know if other families do that. Um, and I don't really know why. We've kind of always done it, even though it's my brother's birthday. I don't know. So, anyway... What I got this year is amazing. First of all, um, I'll show you. I got Hello Kitty. Um, I don't know, little kid plastic cup. And I got a plate. Oh, she's upside down. I got a plate and a little bowl, and I use them all the time with my Hello Kitty chopsticks that I use to eat everything, um, which I guess is actually like, a, I don't know, an eating disordered thing. I didn't really realize it. I use chopsticks to eat, like, everything. Um, or I use one-fourth a teaspoon to eat my yogurt, and it has to be a certain spoon. Anyway, that is a, another video, maybe for the future. Um, but yes, Hello Kitty. Yes, I love her. She's so cute. <laughs> oh, and I love little Japanese people because they, I don't know, I just have this obsession with Asians. Um, anyway, have you guys seen the movie Despicable Me? Because if you haven't, you need to see it. It is my favorite movie. Okay, maybe not my favorite, but um, I love the movie, and I quote it all the time, especially this one part where um, the little girl in it sees this fluffy unicorn, and my mom got me a unicorn that's fluffy. <laughs> and um, it's actually a pillow pet, which is kind of weird. You, like, strap this thing. It's kind of high. Okay, let me show you. It's kind of huge. It's taking up my entire screen. So it's a it's a pet, and then when you want it to be a pillow, you do that, and it's a pillow. Anyway, um, the thing that I quote is when the little girl is like, "If it's so fluffy, I'm gonna die." And if you have not seen the movie, you probably think I'm a crazy person right now. But um, I will leave a link to that little scene. Um, there's a YouTube video. It's really short. Um, watch the whole thing because the ending is really cute because that's when she's like, it's so fluffy! And I love that part. And so I walk around the house all the time now and just like hold it and just quote the movie all the time. In fact, people knew that I love the movie so much that on Valentine's Day, I got three unicorns. I got this pink one. That's so cute. And I got this really tiny cute one. Can you see it? It's so cute. So if you guys have any like weird unicorn things that you like, make a video and show me because I have a slight obsession with unicorns lately. I don't know. I'm 21. You'd think I would have gotten over that a long time ago. But no, I, I have this obsession with unicorns now and Hello Kitty. So anyway, I'm sorry. I am, I have not made a video, so I'm kind of out of the whole video. I don't know loop thing, so I'm ranting a lot and going off on tangents. Anyway, um, things right now have been up and down. Um, you know, I kind of thought maybe recovery would be like just, you know, slow, steadily getting better, you know, 
But no, it's been like a roller coaster. It's like, woo, and you know, you're high one moment, down another. Yes, I am giving you a visual aid with my hand. Um, but yes, um, it's not been smooth. And some days really suck. <laughs> and actually most days really suck. And then every now and then I'll have a good day. Um, yes. So, um, I've kind of felt like I wanted to give up on therapy and give up on seeing my dietitian because I don't know, I, I am not ready to gain weight. And until I'm ready, then I'm not going to start following the meal plans that she gives me. Um, because I'm scared to gain weight and whenever I start to go up like a pound or two, I freak out. Um, so I kind of feel like I'm wasting money seeing her. I'm wasting her time. So, um, I was just kind of feeling down and I did so horrible this last week that, um, the day before my appointment, which was supposed to be on Monday, I called and canceled it. Um, and I've never canceled the appointment yet. Um... So I had to cancel it, and I didn't have to cancel it. I decided to. Um, and instead, I had a girls' day with my friend Nicole, which was really fun. Um, I have not worked out for ages, and we decided um, we went to a yoga class at the Y, and it was so much fun. Um, I can do yoga because it's not cardio, um, and it's actually a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. I am super sore actually, still, and it's been like, what, two or three days? Um, the class is great. It was kind of funny when she brought the little bell things, and I'm like, what's going on? And she's talking about all these inner chakra, something, I don't, I don't know, some weird thing. But it was fun, and it was cool. I think I'm going to do it again. I was going to do it this morning, but I slept in on accident, kind of. Um... Yes, but there was this like anorexic chick in the class and it kind of ruined my yoga class because, I don't know, she was like deathly skinny and um, afterwards Nicole and I were like, dude, did you see the anorexic chick? Like, I felt so bad for her. She looked miserable and um, Nicole said something that I don't think she realized how it could have hurt me, but it kind of did. Um, she said, uh, oh, you're not as skinny as her. And, like, okay, I love Nicole, I love you. But you don't tell someone, like, you don't compare them to another anorexic chick or to any other girl, really. You don't say, oh, you're, you're bigger than them, oh, you're smaller than them. Just, just leave that out. Don't, don't go there. So that kind of ruined part of my day because all I was thinking about was, well, I want to be as skinny as her. Um... Even though she looked miserable, I want to be that thin because I want to be that miserable. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. Anyway. Um, but yeah, otherwise it was fun. We went shopping and I had a kind of an eye-opener. Um, I haven't gone shopping for clothes in a while and um, it kind of surprised me that uh, I am double zeros in jeans. And... A few of the places that I went to to try them on, the double zeros were too big. They were too, like, baggy in certain parts, and it just kind of was like an eye-opener. Like, maybe I'm not as fat as I think I am, and I should know that. I mean, logically, I know that, but anyway. Um, so that was interesting. Um, I didn't really know what to think about that. I still don't know what to think about that. Um, let's see. I only have, like, one more minute. Yes, my boss. It was kind of weird. He pulled me aside like multiple times in the same day and he had like teary eyes. I don't know where this pen came from. Um, he like was all teary and he was like, um, I really think you should consider taking medical leave and talk to your parents about it. And he gave me like all the numbers for it. And I don't know. It's like medical leave. Like why would, what am I going to do in my free time? I'm just going to stay home and binge. Like, I don't know. I'm So I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about taking medical leave maybe for like a month. Um, so it's an option. Um, I better go now. But I'm sorry this video is kind of everywhere. And look, you can actually behead the unicorn. I just found that out. That's kind of morbid. Anyway. Okay. I'm going to end this video now because I'm getting a little crazy. Um, I will make another video soon. Let me know how you guys are doing. Make me a video. Let me know how you're doing. Okay, bye.